You see, if he is your father, that means you're carrying his DNA. That's what Christ was saying. Hi, family. Welcome to the channel once again. Thank you for being there and being always active family. I want to listen to another amazing sermon from Pastor John Anoseke family. You know that when it comes to the of God, he's so deep into it and he says it as it is family. And that is so amazing. Now, he revealed why God created us in his image family. We've all heard this sermon several times that we are in the image of God, no. But why do you think God made us in our image? Now, this is where Pastor John Anosuke explained, gave deeper meaning to these things, explained why God made us in his own image. This sermon is really going to make you not look down on yourself again, family. By the time you listen to the entire sermon you never look down on yourself again you know why you were christian you know why you were a child of god this sermon is in two phase family the first part he explained about how christians can be perfect because you know we are born of god or we are in the image of god we carry the image of God. And the second part that I will introduce is about we being, we carrying the DNA of God. From let us watch the first video together as explain that we can be perfect. Let's watch the video. Let me tell you one of the reasons God made you in his image. You see, because God wield all of his characteristics in his image. So to take on the image of God empowers a man to live out, to exhibit, to reflect, and to manifest God's character. Not in just in words, but in conduct. Not just in conduct, also in ability, in power, in glory, in holiness. In righteousness you know that God is righteous one of the characteristics of God one of, one of the attributes of God is righteousness one of the major attributes of God is holiness one of the attributes of God is immutability meaning he is incorruptible he's absolute so to bear the image of God to be image of bearers of god what does it mean we have been called to manifest his excellence and that's what the bible says be ye perfect for i am perfect is it be, say be perfect that's what the book of matthew it says be ye perfect for i am perfect be perfect be perfect meaning what because now you are the image bearers of god so you can be i am because you can you are and you can because i am this is so clear you all heard from uh, pastor john and also okay so it's very clear so jesus christ said it that i'm perfect so we should also be perfect so it is so clear so because he's perfect and he made us in his own image then perfection also in us we can become perfect in the things we do perfect in our marriage perfect in our career perfect in our education, perfect in everything that we do. Let us watch the next video as it speaks that we carry the DNA of God. Let us watch it family. So, be ye therefore perfect. E even as your father which is in heaven is perfect. What is the meaning of that? You see, if he is your father, that means you're carrying his DNA. That's what Christ was saying, you can be perfect because you are born of God. It is not a gift. You are not perfect because you claimed it as a gift. Mm -mm. It is an ability to exhibit Christ's character, excellence, nature, and attributes of God. Because it runs in your vein. Because the confession church, confess and have it church, we say, 
I am perfect because my father is perfect. I don't have to do anything to be perfect. We grew up with, I mean, we read those nonsense. No, 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 that's a lie. Perfection has to do with a state of holiness. A state of holiness. Where what moves God is what moves you. What he hates is what you hate. What he does not do is what you don't do. That's perfection. In the state of perfection, Satan will not have any room to talk to you. He will not have any room to afflict you. He will not have any room to infect you. He will not have any room to abuse you. You know why? Because every room in you has been preoccupied, completely, absolutely occupied by the presence of Jesus. Shout amen, sons of God. Wow, from this is so deep from Pastor John Anoseke. Wow, what a wonderful sermon, family. So we carry we carry the DNA of God in us. And we being perfect or being righteous or being prospered is not a gift. Because we are born of God, because we are in the image of God, these things were already imbibed and they are embedded in us. It is part of us, you know, to be perfect in the things we do as jesus christ himself is perfect family this is some of the truth that you know in the church so many ministers i think they are afraid to you know be preaching these things they might say it is it is a kind of you know uh fear you know in the church to be speaking this but this is scriptural family so this is how you are so never belittle yourself because you are in an image and carrying the DNA of God, everything that is God is also in you. Family, thank for watching the video and thank for being there. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.